All right, everyone. Hello. We're playing uh, Vampire Survivors today. Yeah, I'm not really sure. Okay, well, so we've got a crazy, um, crazy game where I think it's just face wave after wave of presumably vampires. I think this is us in the middle. Got some lady doing a bayonet pose there. Probably less said about that, the better. But uh, <laughs> but yeah, so basically we just, uh, I think it's just waves and waves and waves. And it just becomes crazy as the screen gets filled up as you uh, do more and more stuff. And I don't know what's going on. Um, let's just see. I think we can't pick, we can't change the character. Got the whip there, so presumably it's based on his face from uh, Castlevania. What's it called? Victor? Yeah. Gains 10% more damage every 10 levels. Max 50%. Alright, so pick him. Alright, we can't change these levels. <clears throat> We've got the Mad Forest. <laughs> Once a thriving haven, now a dumping graph all for evil. A vampire is said to be the root of this evil, but we can find only mayhem and roast chicken. <laughs> okay. I guess that's in reference to sort of Castlevania where you, or games like that where you pick up roast chicken or baddies to restore your health, maybe. I assume, anyway, all games like that, anyway. You know, that kind of thing. All right, let's have a look. So I have no idea what we do. I don't know what the controls are. Maybe I should know what the controls are. Okay. So, not doing very well here. I leveled up, okay. Shoot from damage when active. I don't know how we do all this. Always on the character, fires the nearest enemy. Let's have the King Bible, why not? Did I, uh... Okay. So there's like a big thing on the screen now. I assume I could probably remove that. I'm just holding the button down at the moment. It's like the left mouse button. Okay. Magic wand. Fires at the nearest enemy. Fires quickly in the face direction. Okay. So all these going automatically. Yes, they are. Okay. All right. So as you can imagine... You're just going to get stronger and stronger, basically, as the game goes on. And I think the baddies get, well, obviously, will get harder and harder. It's just difficult because you've got to, like, face the, the, you've got to walk into the bad guys to kill them. And obviously, I want to be running away from them, so it gets it quite difficult. So I don't know if I've, I've got to try and get somewhere, by the way. Maybe I've got to try and move somewhere. Not considered that. I was just running around killing stuff. <laughs> Is that something in there? I don't know. Oh, goodness me. So you can see, okay. Armor, okay. Reduces incoming damage by one. Increases retired damage by ten. Okay, we'll do that. Do you get any swarms of bats? So you've got to kind of keep on the move, I think. So you can see it's quite a basic graphic game. So yeah, I assume it's probably randomly generated. There's loads of stuff here. And we could do some health, couldn't we, really? I think that blue bar at the top, presumably, is your uh, experience. We're almost dead. I guess, it, is it a roguelike game? Maybe it is. This one will get surrounded, basically. I think it's just a bit... Like we are doing. <laughs> For some reason, I'm always... Uh... Fires one more projectile. Shoot some damage when active. Fires to end the face direction. Okay, I'll do more. You see the bats have been replaced now by skeletons, essentially, so... In fact, I don't actually need the arrow buttons. I was using the arrow buttons, I could just use the mouse. What's this lucky clover? Plus 10 something. Okay, so I was using the mouse before. I think that was causing me the problems and what was causing the thing to appear on the screen. And I don't know if I'm losing out on anything here. All we've got is... I mean, I'm, I'm, should I be trying to get somewhere? That's the thing, isn't it? I'm not really, because I'm not doing. <laughs> It'll be nice to uh, get some health. That was close. Okay, so all these plants there. Can we kill them? Possibly need to do that. Okay. Fire one more projectile. High damage, high air go. One more projectile, why not? Although these plants are surrounding us, look at this. We've got to get, I didn't realise that, look at that. 
I'm actually just encroaching us. Oh, there we go. We got rid of them. Well, they went. <laughs> Definitely got rid of them, but... That guy's pretty strong. For whatever reason, there's less baddies, but I think they're stronger. They're swarming on us again. I don't know what the objective is. I mean, there's a time, a time up there. I don't know. Well, some arrow there pointing where to go. Okay, I didn't notice that before. Oh, there you go. Look at that. Treasure found. Open. Okay. <laughs> so we got a disco. We got some kind of wand of doom. What does that do? Can I pick it? Can I do anything with it? Done. Fires one more projectile. Okay, so it's kind of like a level up bonus that you just get without needing to level up. Money bag there. Oh, goodness. Okay. Uh, it's close. Level up. Generates damage zones. Cool damage reduced by two seconds. Hmm. I don't really like it reducing damage because technically you want to be killing everything, don't you? Create generates damaging zones. I don't know what that means. Ah. Whoa. Be careful those bats. We've got some kind of arrow on the screen telling us we need to go down there. <laughs> it's quite a good fun. It's a very basic game, but it's quite good fun, actually. Okay, so we're aiming for this treasure chest down there. Can we get to it? The bats don't want us to. Oh, no, we died. Oh, it's this game over. All right, find a little clover. All right, okay, oh, there we go, all right. Okay, reach level five. We unlock wings. So we unlock all these other things. I don't know what they mean. All right, let's start again, see what happens. All right, so have we got anything? I think we just unlocked powers we can find, basically, I think. Let's go down here, get all this experience. Let's look, experience. look at all this. Goodness me. We are leveling up. Character gets lucky. I'm going to go high damage. We're just going to go all out damage this time, I think. I think damage is certainly the, the better thing to go for if you can. Because you want to be killing stuff, you know. I'm not sure what the money does. I assume you spend it at some point, but I don't know where. We're getting a bit surrounded here. Try and get some experience. Plenty up here. Yes. One more projectile. Inflicted damage by 10%. Which is quite good, really, but... One more projectile is presumably more than 10%. And it's all right. I haven't seen any plants yet, but I'm assuming it's only a matter of time. Here we go, yeah. <laughs> also... It's just up there. There we go, we got rid of him, look at that. Yes. Treasure found, what have we found? Okay, looks good, whatever it is. Another axe, is that level 3 axe, I think? Level 2 axe, we'll leave it. Okay, fast one projectile, we go up a level as well. Augments health by 20%. Okay, we're just we're getting quite we're getting quite powerful now. We're leveling up quite quickly. Base damage up by base damage twenty. Collected damage by ten percent. We'll go for that this time. Be careful not to get too complacent with how well we did a second ago. And we got the chicken. We got the chicken. A different colour one there. Must be more experienced, maybe. 
level so we just need to level up <laughs> quickly if we can level me up yes base area up by 25 not sure what that means space speed up go for that sounds quite good seems like a very big buff Have a look, yes. Magic one cooldown by 0.2 seconds. I don't know what the cooldown is on it. Uh, damage up by five. Okay, yeah, so again, all those damage zones now, which looks quite good. It's quite good because we can just walk in. So, what's that, crisps? <laughs> because it's money, I think. That water's pretty good because we can just walk into it. You know, it gives us a bit of a zone to where... Whoop. There's nutters doing. I think they're pushing along the monsters with them, aren't they, I think? There's bats. Plants again. Nearly up a level, I think. Can we get out? Goodness me. We just have to walk through it. We just have to walk through. Get the chicken. Yes. Okay, so you can just walk through the plants, which is possibly a tactic. Well, it is a tactic. It's one we just used, so. <laughs> Got some more chicken. Yes. Oh, goodness me. No. Right. Okay. You just have to walk through it. Ah. No, we're doomed. Oh my goodness, how have I stayed alive? Oh, we did all right there, though. We did okay. Did all right there. Look at that. Hold six different weapons at once. Yes, we'll accept that. Unlocks empty tome. Unlocks crown. We'll accept the crown. Okay. All right. So, I mean, I don't know what you've got to do, you know, but yeah, okay. <laughs> oh, no. Here's where it all goes. Oh, dear. That's the bit we have trouble with every time when we get those skeletons. Find five floor chickens and a lot of garlic. Okay. What's this power up do? Oh, so we can buy things from the start, can we? That's pretty good. No oh idea. Right, we're doomed. <laughs> we are literally doomed. Yep. We can't, we just can never get past that bit. That bit we can never get past. To 5,000 enemies. There we go. We're not lightning ring. Okay. Okay, well, let's try again. <laughs> Luckily, we're re equipped just to get rid of these for the moment. Werewolves now. Okay. Let's increase our movement speed a bit. Got all these werewolves. Ah. Okay. We need some chicken. This is the furthest we got. Mm. Let's find a chicken soon.
There's loads of lamps there, but I can't get to them. No. Oh, we just got surrounded there. We're not bad, though. We did okay, level 17. Oh, goodness me. As a result, we haven't we really got that before. Mad Forest normal, gold times one. All right. I think when these come, you just got to run through them. And just hope for the best. And that's what I'm doing. <laughs> I don't know if I'm going to survive long here because I, I just don't have the offensive capability this time. Yeah, I didn't have the I just didn't have the offense that time, unfortunately. Did alright though, but let's have another run. Why not? No, it's just too hard that bit without the garlic. I mean, I really struggle with it. Okay. Yeah, we, we had no chance then. Just got, we just didn't have a decent enough build for that, really. Find a vacuum. Unlocks Clock Lancet. All right, so I did all right there. Philo Tour 4 unlocks Arca. Okay. Definitely unlocked some good stuff there. Because we don't do just much damage to anything other than the uh, skeletons, really, at the moment now. We have got the movement speed, which is good. What is going on? Whoa. I'm about to die. We need a turkey dinner, big time. Oh, we just didn't have the hell. We needed a turkey dinner then. We did a turkey dinner. Oh. The garlic really helps on that. You know, I think it's going to be very difficult to do that bit without the garlic. So this is why we needed a turkey dinner. Because we just can't get through all these. Yeah, we had no, we, we just, we didn't have enough firepower, you know, we couldn't get through them all. All right, so we got a few things out. Oh. I mean, despite that, look at that, how are we going to kill all those? Got to level 25, maybe that's a bonus to level 25, I don't know, but there was no way we could do all that. That was just ridiculous. Well, he's level 20 in the Mad Forest and lots inlaid library. Yes, we've done. We got a, oh, got a new level. That's not bad, is it? Not sure. It should be anywhere, somewhere around here now. There, the coffin. Yes. Well, that was a good timing. Now we lost some guy. Thank you, Antonio Belpasse, but the vampire's in another coffin. <laughs> All right, okay. We've got this time. Pugnala Pravala. Welcome, I guess. Yep. Quit. So right, we did rubbish that. Find and open the coffin in the mad forest. Done. Yes. I certainly do want to be uh, killing all these if we can. We got the treasure stuff. We have to get it. Look at that. Super duper treasure time. Super duper treasure time. Yes. We'll have that. We'll definitely do that. Eight nine four, not bad at all. We'll take it. We'll certainly take it. Should look through all the other things though. Didn't really do it. Oh, 
Okay. There we go, the chase chest, not bad. Okay. Got your Bible, I think there's that increase uh, your damage. Good, uh, not a bad one. Okay. Just getting ridiculous again. Okay. All right, great stuff, yes. Oh, I'll stumble. That's good. Looks good. <laughs> Whatever that is, I like it. Okay, yes. Oh, it's a super chest. Yes, super me up, Scotty. Super me up. We'll take it all day long. Wow, so we've got the upgraded whip. Got all sorts. The upgraded whip is amazing because as I say it will uh, absorb HP. Put to the left a bit, so we do want to get those things now. May as well get them. This is a big guy now, I wanna Get that chase chest that we did. Let's see what we got. Alright. Scythe, yes. That's not bad. That places the axes, I think. Alright, so that'll be just ridiculous now. Look at that. <laughs> the damage is just ridiculous. We got a chest. It's a super duper super chest. Super me up. Yes, got the skull as well. Oh, so I think we're going to collect that. And then, uh, right, Hellfire, pre fi uh, right, evolved fire one passes through enemies. Increases enemy speed, health, quantity, frequency. Skullomaniac. Yeah, why not? <laughs> Why wouldn't we get it? Yeah. That's right, so everything else. We just want experience. And the knives, we're firing knives in the direction we're walking as well. That probably helps. It's okay. <laughs> it's just ridiculous. We just <laughs> destroyed the, the big one. Almost as easy as we destroyed everything else. We just, we just destroyed everything here. It's, it's, it's good fun, I must say. Okay, so wow, what does this mean? Evolve cross, so we've improved the cross now. Goodness me. Well, base area damaged by two. Look at the size of our... Goodness me. Has it? Gold fever. Okay. Upgraded the daggers, have we? Evolved knife fires with no delay. Oh goodness me, this is just ridiculous. This is ridiculous. OK, 
Okay. So you just smell the point now where you're just getting money now. <laughs> What's going on? Just level about 20... <laughs> Is that the lucky thing? Maybe I don't know. Who knows? For this me. This is basically throwing us everything it can at us now. There's literally no point in us getting a turkey dinner. We just absorb so much health anyway. Because of our base, because uh, of our garlic. So I took a bit of damage there. Have to be slightly careful. Alright. That's 10 more levels, I think. It's just ridiculous. It's just ridiculous. Just being slow on that, just in case we uh, we take the wrong one accident. We just want money. All right, so we're just gonna. I wonder if at some point you get to the point where you can actually kill the bad guy who comes after you, because it is only level ninety you get to. You'd expect. There you go. We did stop him slightly there. Stage completed. Level eighty-two. See something hit him then, he stopped for a second, didn't he? So I wonder if there is a point where you can kill him, I don't know. Alright, yes, defeat the mad giant blue Venus in the mad forest. We did it. And five has a coin single run. What's the Mario? So five twenty minutes with at least plus ten curse. Evolve the knife, yes. Alright. Unlock hyper mode for three normal stages. Yeah. Great stuff. Alright guys, well I hope you enjoyed that. Yes, I'll uh, might perhaps I'll try to have a new character next time. So yeah, I'll see you next time. Bye for now.